Okay, I'm gonna start the run now. <laughs> Three, two, hey, one. Hey, let's go. go! Okay, I, that's probably. That Wait. jump right there, that's probably just a good old fashioned. <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> this looks so wrong. Jump like thing. <laughs> god. Yeah. Yes, Bugs Bunny playing piano. I love it. Anyway, <clears throat> that, that's the, the nothing. Just I the could video. see casual players loving this. Yeah. Dude, the jump is so good. I mean, compared to I AI, mean, this is amazing. It's just one extra jump. It's point. just yeah. one. That's it. <laughs> okay, I'll 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 yeah. attempt to some a more. Such a to notice, but Baby Robo was in the original as well. It is in the original. You had to play all 50 mini games to unlock him, though. And then Which means the you had to play through rock, nerd. paper, scissors, Holy and shit, sumo, oh paper, God. wrestling, and, you know, jigsaw oh puzzle, God. trombone. The trombone was kind of weird. <laughs> all of the mini games are kind of weird. Honestly, the Wii was just full of mini game collections. The Wii Wii was just 12 full of, like, minigame collections? Yeah. <laughs> Why did you say the Wii Wii? Okay, I'll try to stay all over time Wii. then. I'm cracking open the cold one. I showed you what? that video, Cherim, and you just, like, your mind got destroyed. <laughs> does, um, be, like, does he have the same I speed can't. strat as I? I? No, I'm I not gonna attempt it. No, um, Baby Robo has the exact same. No, he's the only character with 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 three point speed. Um, no, wait, no, no, no Mimi has three point speed as well. Um, he's the only character with. No, he and Baby have three point jump. Um, Professor, don't he has he has three point everything except weight, which is max. Yeah, but Baby Robo doesn't break bumpers, <laughs> sadly. Oh, I think that's tied to your size. Yeah. Yeah. Because Gon Gon's the only one that can break bumpers, and he's the only one that has a size of four. Everyone yeah. else has three or lower. Oh my goodness, this is hilarious. Oh my goodness. <laughs> that cat. Not perfect RNG. Da -dum -bum -bum. <coughs> Double not perfect RNG. Ba -dum -bum -bum. Triple Low not. Wind. Give me the oh. wind, please. <laughs> Come on, dude. Oh, wind. Wind. Third. Thank Don't you. Punch me. Hey, what could the be? What could the BBHD? Can I give you a? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Can I give you a Uki? Look on. Oh my god, sorry. I want to see how much BBHD is for Xbox One right now. I don't know. Whoa, whoa, the console dude, versions like... are forty bucks, but the Steam version goes for sale like all the time. Yeah! Okay, Microsoft Store. Microsoft, yeah. Microsoft. I don't, I don't know why it's 40. Oh my god, three stars? Yikes. It was on sale during like, um. I bet a lot of the reviews are like, this isn't Monkey Ball 1 or 2, herder. Ro oh so my god. Just the second Game, point. Game GameCube had the best Monkey Ball. This was, man, maybe for a $9.99 sign. <laughs> I wow. just would be like, this is the worst Monkey Ball in existence. They still buy that bitch anyways. <laughs> yep. God. What's that one What's Nick that Robinson one? meme? People buying BBHD even though they know it's a bad game. Can I please get the 2 3 skip? <laughs> People buy BBHD the future. <laughs> Didn't they disband the dev team? That's what I heard last stream. But yeah. I don't know. Cause like the Twitter it doesn't do updates anymore. And I don't know if that little Japanese question card thing is updated anymore. Didn't the Monkey Ball Twitter follow you guys or something? That 
it, they did not follow me. They followed um, a lot of the Japanese runners like Taco and EIP25. Wait, you mean the Monkey Ball tweets? Yeah, no, not yeah. Monkey Ball tweets, the official Monkey Ball <laughs> server. Oh no, they didn't follow they, me. Monkey Ball tweets followed me a long time ago. What's Monkey Ball tweets? Monkey Ball tweets is like the basically the fan content for Monkey Ball. Like recently, they just put out some vaporwave esque shirts out, and I wanted to buy it, but I also, you know, want to save my money and not spend it on stupid things. So, plus, I don't yeah. know how often I would wear it because I'd look like a jackass. So, <laughs> yeah, that's a fat mood. Not gonna lie. Legit, like. All of the Vaporwave merchandise, they look so cool, but the only people that wear them are like the edgy hipsters that don't care. Why can't they just go with the new, like the old designs? Can they just bring that back? The old designs of Monkey Ball? Alright, alright. Yes. Hot take. The old designs of Monkey Ball are outdated. It's what? Yeah. I'll say it. I'll say it. Uh, I guess so. I think that the, this version of, like, they might be, like, cuter or whatever, but Monkey Ball was never really meant to be realistic in the sense. It's a, just meant to be a wacky, fun ball rolling game, and I think that this new design accurately Can I play funny about the game? I think like a good way to put it is that it the the old games itself aren't outdated. Alex Alden actually they're, 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 they're not they're outdated. Good. They just don't look as good as the others. Well, but compared to like the game design and like nowadays, like then it's like it just doesn't. Look good. Yeah, it doesn't That's look weird. great. Okay, time for bullet barrage. Yeah. I never know whether to call these missiles or bullets. Partly because I don't know if that this offends is a family people friendly or not. Stream, so it's, we're gonna call them. If this is not a family friendly stream. I don't know what you're talking. About. <laughs> we're, gonna call them, we're gonna call them hurting pellets. This is a family hurting pellets. Bro, okay. So I be we're gonna call them. And I have one of my friends like, and, like, No. And he died people. too. Oh. He has the highest weight though. I don't understand how I got knocked off. I must have been like right close to the edge or something. You must have died. You must have been like really old because baby's really old. That is true. Who isn't old these days? You know what, Twix? We all are. Yeah. Okay. I don't. Yeah. I don't. I don't feel like my. Actually, no. I don't look like or feel like my age sometimes. <laughs> no, I <laughs> screwed up. Sometimes. <laughs> Aaron, what is what question do we have? Also, hot take. Um, he's. <laughs> what? What? Also, hot take. Um, adventure is underrated. <laughs> adventure is. Yeah, I don't know about that one, Chief. <laughs> Story mode? No, definitely not. Challenge mode? Yes. Did you say adventures underrated? See, okay, here's why I say this, because I'm one of those people who will enjoy a bad game, even, even if the game is bad. Like, well, this is different, but I beat Sonic Adventure when I was 12. I enjoyed that game. Same with Adventure, except when I got to Montropolis and I couldn't get past the sticky ball part, that game, like, that part kept giving me a headache. But regardless, I I thought that it was just very, you know, unique to the series that they brought story mode, but the mechanics just didn't fit. And the execution was just god awful. But I would I would honestly play the story mode to fight the bosses in Banana Blitz. That's that's also my hot take. <laughs> that's fair. The bosses in Banana Blitz are super hit or miss. Ready? Yeah, no. <laughs> like that, that was honestly the entire reason why I did not, um, well, I, I, I was more or less reluctant against running PPHD because I didn't I didn't want to reset my runs to, to the to the bird. So, 
so. That's why I didn't do casual course runs. I'll do standard course runs and expert course runs any day. But I'm not losing my run to stupid bird RNG. Y yeah. <laughs> no. But even, but but even then, like, if I had to pick a least favorite monkey ball game, I would have to say Banana Splits. <laughs> Wait, really? Yeah, mainly because of Advanced and Master. <laughs> Wait, you've played, played it before? Yes, <laughs> I played it and beat it, and it was like the hardest one of the hardest things I've ever done. Ugh. <laughs> but I mean. It advances okay until you get to like the ending sections where you're just like, okay, these levels should not be this badly designed or horribly difficult, you know? I um, think the thing that kills it is the diagonals in the game are so messed up because the Vita thumbstick or whatever was not designed for diagonals. It, no. <laughs> oh <Yeah>. no. <laughs> I have a couple of ILs on it, not records, but like I did a couple of ILs and they were okay, but the, the game itself was just not fun. And like the custom level aspect of it, no. You, you just take a picture of something and then it turns it into a level. Like, dude, seriously? And then the level turns out to just be super like mishmash of whatever. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh. 3D is a close second because, well, number one, the game is boring. Number two, the game is easy. Number three, number numbers one and two. <laughs> yes. The game is dummy thick. Heck the yeah, game is. is dummy thick? Bruh. Yes. Interval one. Interval one. Finally got the banana bunch after like a million years of trying. Yay. <laughs> Why is like baby like flapping like that? Um, that's his that's robot. Yeah, that's how he. The fuck is his robot? <laughs> baby is the genius, even though he's baby. That sounds like my um, you know, I don't know. Haha, -ha, oh, oh. I'm baby. I, I honestly hope Sega announces something Monkey Ball related this summer. Do you really I think hope that so. will happen? Well, I mean, they're bringing back classics like Fantasy Star Online, um, Soccer Fantasy Wars, Star Online has... This is the first time that it's been localized in the West. It came out in 2012. Uh, oh. Yeah. Wait, I thought Fantasy Star Online came out in the U.S. for the Dreamcast and GameCube. It did. Fantasy Star Online 2 came out in Japan in 2012 and was said to be localized the next year. It took seven years to do that. <laughs> oh, oh, two, okay. Hey, better late than never, am I right? <laughs> I guess. Well, now people are saying that the Windows 10 version, um, it uninstalls itself after like a day or so. <laughs> Only Sega, folks. Only Sega. <laughs> so, I would get the Xbox One version, but I don't have an Xbox One, so I'm screwed. Rip. But yeah, for Sega, like, like 2019 was like the year of comebacks. Like, Puyo, Monkey Ball... Wait, um, Puyo in 2019? Yeah, Champions came out in 2019 in the US. Oh, it came out 2018 in Japan, and I got the Japanese yeah. version when it launched. Uh, wow. Nice. I legit made an account, a Japanese account, just so I could buy Puyo Puyo Esports. <laughs> See, I wanted to do that, but I was like, uh, I don't know how that would work, you know, transferring my money from... No, you buy a uh, gift card on PlayAsia. Oh. Well, um... I, I could have done that. <laughs> Going the extra mile, are we? Hey guys, uh, dips. But you know my deal with the Japanese voices. Me, no, don't do them. <laughs> you don't do the Japanese voices? <laughs> no, um, except for Puyo's son, because that's only in Japanese. <laughs> what about, Why? um, no, Puyo Puyon is too weird. Oh yeah, the uh, Puyo 4? Yeah. yeah, Puyo Puyon. 
which is for actually, in Japanese. It's funny and quirky like that. I actually want to play Puyo 4 on the Dreamcast, but I'm too lazy to go get my Dreamcast, and I'm also too lazy to download the um, ISO onto a disc. <laughs> That's fair. That's actually how I played Fever on Dreamcast. <laughs> Puyo pop fever. Watch me now. <laughs> Watch me take a shit down. <laughs> oh. Uh, no. I'll do my best. Tails? <laughs> yeah, that, yeah, that's totally Tails. No, that's Arl. <laughs> Arl should be in Tails. Smash Tails confirmed. Yes! Oh my goodness! Oh, oh, I remember there was a whole thing going around that she cool. she was gonna be DLC five, but she wasn't. Well, it was well, Violet instead. <laughs> well, I mean, well, okay. Nintendo has already decided on the DLC characters, like. So it could be Arl, but we don't yeah. know. <laughs> See, the first character is Nintendo, so How the next Arl character is Arty. So we got Sega. Come on now. <laughs> Joker was Sega technically. Yeah. Well, okay, we Sega had... has a lot of properties. They have Sonic, they have Ryu and Ken, they have Bayonetta, they have Joker. Did you say Ryu and Ken? That's Capcom. Shut up. I think, I think, uh, I think Interval meant Virtual Fighter. <laughs> virtual I mean, Fighter. Akira, Akira and Jackie. Yeah. Those. It, yeah. Shh, we don't we, we don't need to talk about that. <laughs> I was mad when Shadow was deconfirmed as a character, but actually he may have a chance because you know Arms is getting in the Arms is getting into Smash. And That's Spring true, Man but it could be a book. different um, character from this from the game. Like it could be Helix. I would love to see Helix. Funny uh, DNA cool. man. Helix or Twintel? <laughs> no, God no. Twintel is a Sintel <laughs> midman for the win. Probably win. be Ribbon Girl. <laughs> Ribbon Girl's Ribbon a Girl. Eve costume though. So, so characters can be me costumes. Crom, Link, um, Fox, Captain Falcon. K. Rule. Yeah. Hmm. But I think, uh, let's see, Arms, Arl, Crash. Well, Arl's a hot pick. Um, Crash. Ah, uh, shoot. I'm forgetting. Rex. Ready? I think yeah. Rex will be a definite. Hmm. Let's see, Crash is a PlayStation character, technically. But uh, Sony has... Uh, Sony doesn't have a character. Yeah, because they had to, they tried the PlayStation All-Stars Battle Royale, and that sucked. <laughs> Wait, um... Oh, what's the character's name? Um, Ape Escape. Well, the main character from Ape Escape. <laughs> I don't know what the Gone character's on. name is. Well, well, yeah. I mean, that game is kind of too obscure, but it is a... It's a PlayStation classic. No! Earthworm. Yo, what if that Earthworm Jim I would have survived if I wouldn't have jumped. <laughs> Earthworm Jim? Yo. <laughs> I'd be kind of down for that. Earthworm Jim revitalized? We should add Earthworm Jim and Smash. Uh, oh shoot. Um, let's see. Arms Crash, Lara Croft. <laughs> um, Master Chief. Alright, oh, I'm... Uh, sh should I do bad. the full skip on Pirate's Ocean 2, because I can do it, I'm just getting bad luck with the jumps. I'm really bad at the The what stage? The dummy thick stage. <laughs> just kidding. Nah, just play it safe. Oh, <laughs> too bad. I already did it. <laughs> so stream Third delay. time's the charm. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Yo, baby flies. Holy shit. <laughs> But if, if Monkey Ball were to be in Smash, I would say rip the, rip the move set partially from Adventure and the three D um, fighting game. Yes. Oh yes, Spe specifically Monkey Ball three D. <laughs> yeah, Monkey Ball three D had like a full on monkey fight mode. That was more <laughs> than just oh, yeah. extendable arm punch you in the face. It was like Smash Bros. Almost. Yeah. Were there combos? Yeah. Yeah, they, they were kind of combos, but um, like certain button inputs, they would actually do moves that could actually be plausible in Smash. Like, like literally, like the characters have their own 
um, quote unquote final smash, like whenever you would hit that golden banana thing, they would get a special move. So that was literally a rip off of Smash. <laughs> oh, look, it's I mean, Monkey Race is just rip off Garfield Kart, and then uh, Monkey Fight is just rip off Smash Bros. Yeah. No, it's rip off Street Smash. Street <laughs> <laughs> Smash. Yo, is that uh, Fluxuant Travelator? Um, it can be if Love. you want it to be. No! Uh -oh. I thought I could do that skip as baby, but I guess not. not you have baby, to like go. Robot. You have to zoom on I'm this baby. level to to get that shortcut. I think I can you do it baby. actually. Yes. Open the door. No, I cannot. I'm just gonna do the level normally. I'm losing time. Open the door. You have. To, we have our baby. <laughs> I'm baby. If I were to pick a Sonic character in Smash, no. I would... What? Please, <laughs> Shadow. If I hope Springman gets in just so we can get Shadow Wall and Waluigi, and then if yeah. Ribbon Girl gets in, then we can get Gino. So it's a win-win. That's true, but Sonic. Really watch, I would pick either Tails or Amy. No. Yeah. I'm not Eggman. <laughs> Eggman would be so plausible, actually. Can we get Porky for DLC? Oh my god. Yo, Eggman would be the fastest person in the game, no doubt. Porky? <laughs> What's Porky? I mean, from Earthbound. Oh. He was he was one of the bosses in Brawl. Yeah, oh, no. he was. And he's not in the game in any way, shape, or form. He's not even a spirit. Oh, he's not? Oh, I he got not fucked. Wow. The same, Everyone like, is here. He got killed. Porky. And then they were just like, no, he sucks, don't bring him back. <laughs> he doesn't die though, actually. Funny thing is his end in Mother 3 is like the opposite. He's like for he's like trapped in somewhere forever. Oof. When will Mother 3 come to the US? <laughs> no. <laughs> Dude, Mother 3 is one of my favorite games of all time. I've played it like Bro. five times. Deadass. No, nah, I was like four. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm not lying when I say this. Uh, I played through yeah, Sonic this. Adventure. Oh my god, I'm not lying when I played <laughs> Sonic Adventure three times, twice on GameCube <laughs> because my memory card corrupted, and once on Dreamcast. I'm going for a second time, actually. Once on PC, no, once on GameCube, once on Dreamcast, once on 360. Beat that. Uh oh. Well, um, okay then. <laughs> That's fair. It has it has suddenly turned to a competition. Who has played Thanks. the most versions of Sonic Adventure? <laughs> I've got well, four out of five. <laughs> how many times have you beaten got... Super Monkey Ball 2? Uh... <laughs> Duh, I, I don't want to answer that question. <laughs> I, I, I think Monkey, Monkey Ball 2 is like probably my most played game ever. <laughs> really? Yeah, like, I, I played it a lot before I got Melee, and like, let me think, because that was like the only game game I had, really. Um, I had, oh yeah, I had one, two, Heroes, and I think that was it, yeah. Oh, and, and Mega Collection. It's the Octopus. It's the Octopocus. It's the Tentai. Pretty much. <laughs> it's Taco. It's Octopocus. Yo, hot take. Smash Ultimate. I don't think it's really as good as Rivals of Aether. Oh, that is mean. I have take. not played Rivals of Aether, so I cannot um, give mean... you the approved pass. Let me through. I want to not die. Competitive, like, competitively, I, played... I don't think it's as good. I or played as bad. I played Rivals, and I mean, I would agree. I mean, Smash Ultimate in general, no. <laughs> I mean, it's I play... nice, fast, and not dynamic. You know what I mean? Yeah. You know what's the worst it... part about BBHD? Unless if you play like, is that you what, can't what, squish Halloween, the little green dudes anymore? Fox. Fucking big bad wolf. Big bad mm -hmm. wolf. You can't, you can't the squish the, the green man dudes himself. Yo, I love how this guy murders his uh his minions. What? Oh wait. Oh yeah. Oh, wait. <laughs> You're like 30 you seconds us behind. Get cake. Cause he plays Pikmin. Ah, funny. Pikmin. <laughs> I meant Olimar. <laughs> Yo, is this the only boss without any guardrails? 
No. Wait, where did Sega go? Did Actually, wait. He went to bed. Um, like, even, no, the, uh, even World Eight's boss has some. No, the World Eight has guardrails, sort of. Yeah, it has some. I, I mean, like but so does World Five. 5. It has a little ramp at the very edge, but it's not much. There's no stage that has just a flat surface for boss fights. I mean, technically, if you think about it, um, every boss past World 1 doesn't have guardrails because it doesn't have a fence. Hmm. At least not in the main boss area. Because hmm. 2, 3, and... Four, no, four has guardrails as, as the force field. Yeah. So world five is when it starts. Okay. Have you seen the new strat RTA for this? No. It's where you continue going. You jump on that. Um. You jump at a later platform to avoid the yellow ring, and you just keep going, just nonstop. You don't have to wait for anything. Ooh. Yeah, that's a fat mood. Mm. It's literally me every day when I go to class. Holy shit. If you, if you, well, it's I'm a difficult to strat to pull off, so I can't really remember, do it just yet, but I'm going to practice it. I'm trying to remember if I if, if I tried going for that in regular ILs. M maybe, maybe not. Regular um, ILs, you just have to jump around the thing and hope and pray. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. pretty much. <laughs> How did I do that? Uh oh. Oh, it worked. I don't What's know how I did that, dude. Uh, hey, Super Monkey Ball Deluxe should have also been released for GameCube. <laughs> I mean, now it is for GameCube, so. <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> Man, but it's now. not the same. You can't play both versions of the party games. There's no competition mode and tens. Hey, games. let's go diagonal free. Hey, yeah, let's go. Like part of the collision works differently on the GameCube than on the um, Xbox PS2. Like I remember, I could I could not get certain strats, even though I know I would get it if I was playing on the oh. Xbox version. Yeah, the collision is different. When Moon finally I'm says something. Minecraft. Get out of my room! I'm playing Minecraft. Yo, that that video is so funny. I downloaded the virus on my computer. <laughs> God no. <laughs> oh, I know nice exactly save. what you're talking about. <laughs> you're a nice save. Hey, I'm a moron. Let's go. That entire, that entire exchange, and the mom's voice kills it too. <laughs> oh my god. Doesn't the kid make the mom cry at the end of the video or something? Uh. Yeah, because um, if you listen to like the whole stream, then at the end, the kid is literally like, I'm calling CPS. He's calling CPS? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Just cause his okay, mom walked in on him. <laughs> no, That's your because, own fault. No, no, she hit him because, um, like, he was saying a past time. Amos looking at a computer virus, for he was, sure. He downloaded a computer virus, and he tried to turn it off, and then his pants slipped. This is like something out of a Dr. Phil episode. It really is. <laughs> you guys, I died on Dexter's Desert Stage 2 at the same time. Oh Thank room, God. I'm playing Minecraft! Really? I can't play the game. I suck at it. Are you playing the original or HD? HD. HD. The collision feels different. BBHD. BBHD! Yo, okay, so BB I play high definition. Play. Bro, okay, so I so I played BB Standard Edition for the BBSD. Uh, 
Yeah, for the oh, what's the what's the video I made where where the worlds changed the original game? Anyway, yeah, I did that. So I was I was literally using Aya in uh, World Three, and oh my, <laughs> the like like literally the speed just felt so free. Like I don't know how I got the 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 three two skip as Aya that easy. I'm like, dude, if I tried that BBHD, I would have just died because Aya is so bad. <laughs> Honestly, Aya yeah. is a nerd. Close. Let me get the diagonal, please. Thank you. Did Kirby leave? Maybe. What is it? That was smooth. Ooh. Jump at the end. I'm such a nerd. Nice oh work. my goodness. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's go we'll do a few more attempts. Interval after baby robo, is that it? Um, after baby robo, I have uh, Mimi and Doctor. You're gonna do that all at once? No. Your, 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 I was like, yo, your, your head is gonna be like. I, what I, meant, the, for, why? I meant for today. Why? 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 For today? Why, 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 no, I'm not gonna do that today. Oh, I don't know. Uh. I just realized I'm gonna have to upload all of these runs, and then Jeff is gonna have to sit through all of them. I feel bad for Jeff Compass right now. Oh, um, no. Yeah, because he's the other mod. Or actually, no, Squid's a mod now. He can get my <laughs> runs down. <laughs> that okay, in a second, I'll go sit through the Christmas pack. I want to beat this save, though. I don't think it's gonna happen yes, though. The oh my save God, is find hard. <laughs> I really the save is literally the definition of the math department. I'm yeah, so sorry. No main on deck. Ready? <laughs> I wish that the mods, the one come mods that I download, had the exact same um, file name or oh, whatever. Yeah. Like literally, so that I don't have to keep using the max play points, whatever, and then you know, unlock all the stages, because that was a pain. I mean, most of them have the same um, file name as SMV2, oh. but some of them just want to be extra, so that's yeah. on them. <laughs> yeah, Deluxe is not the same. Um, let's yeah. jump into spikes 25 million times, let's go. <laughs> Oof. Wait, why did you back up the first time? What? Yeah, never mind. Yo, Interval, you're really good at Monkey Ball Banana Blitz HD. Thank you. How did I say the whole name? <laughs> Why did I say the whole name? I'm really I mean, good Interval at Super Monkey Ball Banana Blitz HD for the PC <gasps> yes, published by Sega. Five. Let's go. You mean Super Monkey Ball Banana Blitz High Definition published for the personal computer? Ooh. Wait. <laughs> On the Steam launcher. Oh. <laughs> Create, yeah, 30 minutes. Created and developed by Sega of America. <laughs> for free. <laughs> Not for free. Finally! Hey, got that good quick kill. Go. Hey, we got the we got the cycle skill. Let's go. Oh, I understand how to do it. I understand how to do it. I understand how to do it. Oh crap. No! Oh crap. Oh, if I go on the platform. If I go on the oh, platform. Oh, Scrap since I won. What about, what about Scrap? He said, oh crap, so I said, oh Scrap. Six, oh five, Scrap, 651. <laughs> yeah, I love that guy. Oh shit. Sure. I, 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 I can't real, say. I can real charmer, that one. Yeah, I can't, I can't say the, the, the group name on stream. <laughs> Otherwise I'd be, wait, did that just beat my record? Did it? Wait. We're good. Okay, go back and um, check that out, because I might actually upload that. Wait, hold on. Let me do the math. Hey, let's go. Because I have 3551. Actually, you can just clip it. Clip it. Ready? Yeah. Oh, oh, well, oh shoot. You're right. You're Dude, right. Can we talk about how behind the audio is on the stream? Oh. Oh, well, we yeah, talk, because. Like, it says like five minutes later. Sorry. 
Okay, I should probably jump. At that oh, point. Wait, it was 8388. 8388. Oh, 3612. Okay. Oh, nice parry. I didn't beat it, Those but I got really close. On. Yeah. Yo, Yoko is such an easy boss. No, she's not. You mean Yan Yan? <laughs> Pretty much. Her name is Yoko. Yoko. And then, uh, Back when people, is... back when she was revealed in the game, uh, all these people were like, "Oh my God, she's so cute!" And I'm like, "I know what hell demon you are. I what? know the awful <laughs> times I've had trying to beat volcanic pools with no continues, and then get to that boss and die every <laughs> single time because you time out and the camera is horrible and there's like zero way that you can beat it and it's stupid and dumb." <laughs> Sorry, oh, I have a lot of history with that boss, and no matter how many times people be like, Oh, it's not that what bad, I will lag? refute it. I don't care. Uh-oh, you missed the dub? You missed a lot. I can't wait to see my final death count for this game. It's well, probably gonna be like, there's still guardrails. Only like 9,000. There's still guardrails. There's guardrails on, um, 10 to Jumping into spikes. Plus, oh, yeah. plus, 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 I, plus, I plus. How, I love how jumpy... Uh, basically did my strap, but optimized it by like a couple of frames. I like it. <laughs> Honestly. <laughs> world A is a short world. Compared yeah, to we... other worlds in the game? Like, World 5 is the Boogie. longest world in the game. Boogie? I thought it was 7. It's, it's somewhere around there. Oh, because long. World 5 has the 5-2 skip, but it also has 5-8 and 5-7, so... It has a lot of really tricky levels, hey, but if you get all of go. them, then let's World 7 the is the longest world. Hey, let's go. Oh, fuck. <laughs> There's not really a whole lot you can do to make World 7 shorter. <laughs> well, if you made 7, 8 shorter, then we'd be good. But no, that level is long. That level is <laughs> long. The IL level... IL record on it is 38 seconds, and that Why amazes me. Off? That's nice, that smash. Wait, oh, was, was Jumpy too. using Baby on that level, or, or I'm not sure. I linked the video on the spreadsheet. You can check it out. Oh, you're right. <laughs> Yo, spreadsheety. Spreadsheet. Dude, I updated the high score stuff with all of my scores, and then, like, Pease's two scores. And then I put my... <laughs> 1-1 one, one IL and 1-2 oh. IL I got on Tuesday. <laughs> and, uh, I'm so happy. Although I don't know if you can see it because I put them as unlisted, but they should work. I put them as unlisted so I wouldn't have to spam everyone with notifications like Interval uploaded a video. It's just a 1-1 one, one IL with talking about this is how you do an IL. Why did you quit? <laughs> oh, Why the fuck are you quitting? I'm not quitting, Orgy? what the? No, no, what? Orgy's fucking quitting on me when he's Did you see that? No, Sorry, he's playing Rival Oh. Yeah. Uh, he forfeited when he was 1-0, what the fuck? He was no. looking for that 2-0 flawless victory. Yo. Oh, this is yeah. an underwhelming, underwhelming, okay. an underwhelming final stage of the main story. What? World 8? This boss is actually it's pretty eight. difficult. No, I was talking about the level for it. Oh, Mushroom. So, it has a name now? If, uh, that's what I'm gonna call it. Okay, get mad again. Yes. Captain Krabunkle, wasn't that his name or something? Captain Krabuchin. Carbuncle is the Puyo Puyo yellow dude's name. Yeah. This is good luck, actually. Oh, for speedruns, that is. Because you don't have to react to him spinning around. Oh. Yo, I'm like, why oh, do I say crab? Bad. Why do I say yeah. carbuncle? That was bad luck at, at the end. When when he sticks his... I think that's his... When he sticks his left foot out, that's bad. Because he'll spin faster than he sticks... Then when he sticks out his right foot. That's actually really weird. It. I wonder why he does that. I don't know. That boss is just way too RNG, and I'm glad that Aww. we don't have to fight it in casual course. <laughs> right. Or standard. <laughs> or standard, honestly. 
I've had expert course runs killed on Switch because of input delay on that boss. That, that just sounds like the Switch in general. <laughs> I guess, yeah. Dude, oh, Nintendo no. refuses A to fix their player, online. Jesus Christ. Even when their games are not at Evo, they still don't want to fix it. I mean, they can fix it, but then we'd have to pay prices of Xbox Live and PS Plus and all of that stuff. No, thank you. And it's 20 bucks a year, so I'll take it. I don't care. Oh, no. 20, yeah, 20 bucks a year for Garbage Wi-Fi. <laughs> That's fair. Honestly, like, the Garbage Wi-Fi, some kid nice. probably has to play with that all the time, and I feel bad for them. Yeah. Like, we can complain about it, but, like, someone has to deal with that every single time they're online. Yeah, and Fiber Optic sometimes doesn't even help them either. Yeah. World clear! Wow! I have a USB to Ethernet adapter. No, I don't. I have a USB to dial up adapter. Ah, <laughs> uh, sinking swamp. What a classic. Wow. Sorry. When I was a kid, I was so confused at how Sinking Swamp was the remix Meteorite Mayhem. I'm like, oh, what? Yeah, all remixes of Touch Your Roll songs. Oh, I yeah, was confused on how Zero G Station was a remix of Ultra Heaven for the longest time until I heard that main melody, and I'm like, that's it. You mean yeah. Ultra Heaven was a remix of Zero G Station? That's what I meant Touch to say. S same same with um, Smooth Sherbert being a remix of Ice Lolly Land. Lolly. I couldn't hear it until oh, the yeah. very beginning of the song. I was like, oh, now I can yeah, hear you, it. Yeah, you only hear it in like certain parts. Yeah. I kind of wish oh, that no. um, Jungleistic Journey and Meshmash were um, in the game. Should have had 12 worlds. J the Jungle monkey Lister race Lister. from Touch and Roll made its way into the BBHD. Oh yeah, it did. Because it's in dangerous <laughs> route. That's that's the where I remember. That, that song was by... in the original Banana oh, Blitz too. I... It was. I think it's the only other song from the original Banana Blitz. Wow, I have not failed that in a very long time. This yeah, character is messing me up, dude. Afraid. It's the curse of Baby Robo. <laughs> I, I legit just added funny. Baby Robo as a variable yesterday on SRC. Oh no, we're playing BB, I guess. BBB, I guess. No, we're not. Dude, if I, if I ever play Touch no, and Roll again, are. I'm gonna do a video where I play I, the world. I, I, I no. really. Okay, I like, guess we're getting more consistent, I guess. That would be That'd pretty be... cool, actually. Play yeah. the BBHD version, because I don't want you to suffer through Ultra Heaven. <laughs> Ultra Heaven. <laughs> Whoa. Wow, okay. Oh, Pog. I know, right? Ready? Go. I don't know how I... F mm, I don't know. I checked the, the Squid World Record and it was legit. I just got let down a rabbit hole. Again. But <laughs> mm -hmm. I don't know if I'm gonna uh, enforce the um, original music rule or not. Because it doesn't change anything to the game. I don't know. Yeah. And I kind of spent a little bit of like two hours trying to mod my music. <laughs> oh, <laughs> all that dang. effort would have no. Oh rip! I know, right? I die on the easiest levels, and then like I do saves on like nine nine. <laughs> I, I haven't even got to the hard part of the level yet. If you could even call it that. <laughs> So let's see, I would do, um, oh, what's the, the first world's name? Uh, so it's with the W. Wet and Windy. Um, yeah, yeah, Wet and Windy. Windy. Um, Ready? Fantasy Falls, uh, what's number three? What would be number three? Ice Lolly Ice Land. Lolly, Ice Lolly Land, Blistering Sands, Tempest Storm. Wait, what are you rating this by? No, I'm, 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 I'm doing Studio the- Studio One. The, yeah, I'm, I'm doing the Touch and Roll Worlds, but in Banana Blitz order. Um, oh. Yeah, Studio One. Wow. Power what? Lava, what was um, that collision on? Oh my Power god. Power Lava, Big Bang Boom. Um, uh, Meteorite Mayhem. And Zero G Station. Station. How, how much space do I get for this in stupidity? Alright. 
no idea. Eight more <laughs> stages to go. Okay, this is, this is easy. Wow, that was a save. Hey, let's go. Yes. Is that a 16 pixel? Oh my goodness, that's a 16 pixel, isn't it? Ready? What are the yeah, world bro, order? The audio is not oh, safe. Because I never really understood. Like, I know when Wendy's first, but I never understood um, why, like, Journalistic Journey is second and. Oh, what was third? Blistering um, Sands. Yeah, Blistering Sands. I'm such an idiot. Yeah, yeah, I never played Touch and Roll in the actual world's order, fun fact. <laughs> I just did them all randomly. I thought wow, Blistering Sands was World 2 order. because I'm like, oh, it's a desert level, so that must mean it's in World 2. <laughs> nope, it's oh. 3. <laughs> I think as a kid, I also thought it was a World 2. I, I cannot swear it's not do actually the level. Pixel. Ready? Hey, we're playing kid, PvP it's okay again. Oh, Blistering oh. Sands and Jugglistic Journey because... GG's. Touch and Roll was my first Monkey Ball game, and I, s I was stuck on Starfish for Junglistic Journey, and then I was stuck on Betting Course for, uh, what's your <laughs> Me too. I think everyone was. Stuck on Starfish? Stuck on Starfish, course? Stuck on starfish nope. and Betting Course. I if figured I not... out Betting Course, but it took me years to figure out how to beat Starfish. But then if, when if I, I did, I was able to play the rest of the game, and I loved it. If I had, like, two before Starfish... Um, I would have just been oh, dead as well. Really? <laughs> Come on. I guess this means I'm getting more consistent BV mechanics. I don't get why I'm people, like, criticize touch and roll as being, um, like, having one and two levels and not that many, um, touch and roll levels when Deluxe does the exact same thing. <laughs> Wait a minute, is that, that's, a a that's, that's an easier corner right there. But Deluxe is intended to be a combination of one and two. Oh. But, on, but on Xbox and PS2. <laughs> yeah, but people criticize Touch and Roll as not being original, even though it shows off the DS's capabilities of being able to do stuff like that. It's actually that fun. Imagine criticizing Touch and Roll in general. Honestly. <laughs> maybe, the game I vibe. hate the save. Maybe the D-pad, but everything else, no. The, ga the game is actually insane on the DS. It really before is. Before Diamond and Pearl came out, in my opinion, and New Super Mario Bros. <laughs> Wait, it came out before all of them? Yeah, it came out yeah. in 2005 in Japan, and then 2006 in the U.S. and no, no, Europe. No, 2004 in Japan, and then 2005 in the U.S. No, it came out 2005 in Japan. It, def it definitely was not 2005 in the U.S. because there's the whole collect 2006 bananas. 2006 oh. bananas? What? Yeah, when you beat Studio One, you have to unlock- You have to collect 2006 bananas to unlock World 12. Yeah, okay. Adventure and Touch and Roll- Oh wait, Adventure, Touch and Roll, and- And Banana, Banana Blitz, Blitz were all in the same year. 2006. Yeah. It's funny. I was five when Touch and Roll came out, but I was six when Banana Blitz and, um, well, Adventure and Banana Blitz came out. <laughs> that's, kind of, that's kind of weird, honestly. It is weird. Those oh my goodness! First well, you're the deluxe go. type come out. Uh, March 30th, 2005. Oh, wait, no, not March 30th. It's March 5th, 2005. Let me make sure that I'm right. Hold on. Uh, hey, let's go. March 46.08. I was not expecting a time like that. That's actually pretty good.